Hey guys, Dustin here, CEO of 630. Today we're going to talk about the electric bike tax credit that uh, we've been hearing on the news and Congress talking about, so stick around. All right, so today we're going to talk about the electric bike tax credit, but before we do, hit that subscribe button below, stay in touch with all the videos we're putting out, and be made aware of the weekly monthly contest we're doing here at 630. We're doing weekly monthly giveaways for e-bikes, accessories, and standard bikes. Now, recently in the news, in the last month or so, there's been um, headlines about an electric bike tax credit. Now, as I know right now, this has yet to pass, but I've heard the Biden administration is a very bicycle friendly administration and they're looking for ways to increase the amount of bike riders out there um, to minimize the, the congestion and transportation and build the bike infrastructure. Now the electric bike tax credit, if passed, is going to be a huge, huge bonus um, to anybody out there in the market for an electric bike or it could be a great incentive to get an electric bike even if you haven't been thinking about it. Now, California did this for electric cars, and I think it really worked. It got a lot of electric cars on the road. Um, the tax credit, plus an actual state rebate, plus you would get a carpool lane incentive with the electric car. Um, but the electric bike is an actual tax credit, and the way it works from what I've seen, um, which this may change you know, as the bill comes to be voted on or it actually passes, but how it would work is if you buy an electric bike up to $8,000, you'd be eligible for a 30% um, tax credit of the cost you paid. Now, with that, but the max tax credit would be $1,500. So if you bought an $8,000 bike, your tax credit would be $1,500. If you bought a $2,000 bike, your tax credit would be $600. Now the benefit, this is not a deduction they're talking about, this would be an actual tax credit. So at the end of the year, if you owed zero dollars on your taxes and let's say you bought a thousand dollar electric bike your rebate would be three hundred dollars that would be actually three hundred dollars the government would send back to you in the form of a check so this is real money a real credit something that could really end up in your um, your wallet or your pocketbook so this is um, a huge incentive we'll keep you up to date here at 630 as we hear more about it and find out if the legislation has passed and if it's a federal or a state and how it all works. So again, hit subscribe, stay in touch. And if you have any other questions, comments, or thoughts, or if you have any updates on this topic, please put them below in the comments section or shoot us an email, the team at 630.com or call us 310-982-2877. And if you're in the market for an electric bike, browse our selection on our website. At the top, go to electric bikes. We have a huge selection for men and women. Also take our body fit quiz. You're going to answer questions about your lifestyle, your body type, and our proprietary algorithm will recommend the perfect bike for you. The bonus, we have a 365 day return policy. If you don't love your bike within 365 days, send it back, zero questions asked, no money out of your pocket. And lastly, download our app, 630 Pedaling. Track your miles on every ride and automatically be entered to win weekly and monthly prizes like e-bikes, accessories, and standard bikes based on the leaderboard. If you ride the most miles in a week, you'll be eligible to win a prize. It's a lot of fun. We'd love to have you in the community. So thanks for sticking around, learning about the electric bike tax credit. And don't forget, it's your journey, your experience. Enjoy the ride.